Okay, let's keep it rolling. We've flown through a lot of turns here pretty quickly, which is pretty nice. You know, if there was a city-state around, I'd probably just gift this damn trireme away. Damn. I don't think that trireme's making it back home. Well, suppose I won't have to worry about it anymore, and that's nice. <laughs> I guess. I don't have to consider that. I'll get my national college. A late national college. China's plotting against me. That is awful. Of course, it doesn't mean, it doesn't have to mean anything, but it probably means plenty of things. Okay, I didn't immediately lose the tri- I'm probably gonna lose the tri -reem. Barbarian units are... silly. <laughs> That's the best I got. They are silly. Damn if I don't need that worker. Before the cargo ships, before the charter ships. I'd also like that fourth... fourth city. I mean, you didn't die, so that's cool. Damn it. How did it just delete the damn thing? Like, I can't heal it unless it's in my territory. So that's a problem. Also, whenever I built the lighthouse, I forgot to fix those assignments. That's a terrible job by me. Also, I should probably just do that. Can't be in too much of a rush for this city to grow, and whenever the lighthouse is built, we'll do better production-wise. Yeah, I would like these cities to grow, but I'm just going to have to uh, push it to the side. London will grow to nine population. That is the one city whose growth matters the most. Hi. You know what? I'll just try going around. Will you let me go around you? That'd be really damn super swell. Need so many more improvements. Need so much more everything. Rubbish start. Well... I handled it poorly. I'm sure I could have handled it better. I don't have the most familiarity of this game. Okay, turn 169. We finally got our uh, National College. I'm going to get a worker and then finally get on with some trade routes, which would be very useful for my science. Uh, early game trade routes are incredibly important for science output. I, of course, don't have any of those. Other than the ones the AI has been courteous enough to send my way. For fuck's sakes! Getting to lose my patience. That's also pretty terrible, but... I couldn't have done anything good about that. I wasn't in a rush to settle that city. Uh, I would like to claim this city. And if I don't get it, I would like a city over here. I'd like to be able to use gold to, uh, to buy a settler so I don't have to mortgage city growth. Also, I do not have construction yet. That's true. That was a wasted turn there. Uh, well, that wasn't that bad. Yeah, Beijing being in my face pretty much means that she's, uh, we're gonna have contested borders. She's gonna be pretty good. Uppity. At least I don't have to worry about barbarians right there anymore, though. For the most part. No. I mean, they could still spawn around here. She'd probably see that tile, though. It'll probably be fine. Also, it lot gives me the opportunity to perhaps use... <sighs> what a waste of effort trying to save this damn thing. <laughs> it's still alive. Not anymore. Drove straight into that barbarian encampment instead of, like, moving patiently. Oh, glad we solved that problem. Yay! I get an extra gold per turn now because I don't have to think about that anymore. Neat. Yeah, before the cargo ships, as much as I'd like them. No, I can't say that anymore. Maybe 281 and a gold per turn. There we go. That gives me some nice gold per turn. Well, it gives me some nice flag gold, rather. And I'm not confident in my ability to just buy the damn thing. I don't have a whole lot of happiness for that. 
We're slowly generating faith. We'll get a pagoda, you know, eventually. Also, technology stealing. Guilds. Definitely guilds. Yay! 19 turns. That's gonna help me get caught up. That's what I wanted that extra spy for. You can build that road there. You... All these are jungles. And there's not really a whole lot of good spots for farms. What's gonna be my guild city? That's the best food. Hmm. Hmm. Here? Probably York. Hmm. This is more like a production city. With some science output potential. Hmm. Well, we'll think about that later, I guess. Hopefully, uh, I didn't get noticed, and I'll continue to be able to spy just fine. Yay! Here's my second guy. Chivalry? Oh, that's worth so many beakers. I don't see how I can take that. Neat. 32 turns, huh? That sucks. We'll see whether I'm caught. I could probably do better if I move to another city. Gotta keep that going here. These two spies are uh, gonna be my equalizer. Especially because I am not able to sign research agreements. She doesn't have education yet. Let's see whether Napoleon noticed. Napoleon noticed. I swear not to spy on you anymore than Napoleon. Please don't kill me. Okay. Sort these again. I'm staying away from Korea because I presume they're the tech leader, and so they're probably protecting the uh, their city by having a spy in there. Uh, what I'm going to do here is move into uh, Moscow instead as a spy. Hopefully get uh, some better potential there. That'd be pretty swell. I know a farm there wouldn't be too terrible of an idea due to the lack of food I'm going to have here. Also, I should have... Reset these tiles for better. Nah, roughly the same. By roughly, I mean pretty much the same. Yep. Korea's got their unique unit, the Chukono. The AI does horribly love to build their unique units and uh, put them to great use against my face hall. Also, the city was awfully close to growing. I should let it do that. I should have let it. I should have let it continue to do that. Rather, that was a bit wasted potential on my part. Okay, let's go back to finishing that then. Ten people in London on turn 180. That could definitely be far better. But uh, no ancient ruins, no city states. That's probably why everything's so much slower for me. I haven't had the the. The crutches. Nah, I don't want to tear down the boundaries between our people. I very much like the boundaries, thank you. Currently a religious war going on. Not that I'm surprised by that at all. Okay, uh... Go ahead and work that tile. Move here, place a farm on that. Choose production here. I want it to be a trireme. I want to protect... If these tiles got pillaged, the odds of, like, a barbarian sweeping in are pretty low. But, I mean, a camp could be pretty much anywhere, and I just don't... I don't trust the game, basically. That's what I'm saying. i save that gold for a research agreement. Boudicca's thankfully busy. Uh, China is not. China does like to fight. China does like to do a whole lot of lying. Hey, China. No... Hey, Pakal. Mm. I don't have the spare happiness. That is my final pearl slot. Hmm. Hey, Pakal. Nine gold per turn? 
How about open borders? Okay. That may end up very well getting her, uh, her trade routes with me pillaged, which is incredibly unfortunate. But, uh, damn if I don't want her to stay busy and not eat me. You notice it's a pretty big interest on my part, not getting eaten by the AI. This is just a really weak position for me. I feel so frail right now. Yep, like that. That's gonna kill my science output. I have the extra beakers I was getting and my gold. Napoleon's now declared war on Catherine. Great, he's busy now. Bienvenue, je suis Napoleon. Yes, Napoleon. That's you. Yep. There they go. World's busiest people. I'm not terrible at production. Pakal's pretty much got me doubled, though. Which is all kinds of great. Okay. I want to get that city settled. We're still generating a whopping two faith per turn. I might get a temple. That's how I know I'm desperate. I'm starting to think about getting a temple. I usually don't build those. Just in a bad way for faith. I'm also in a bad way for happiness. I'm back down to zero. I only have one declaration of friendship. And no one really has a... Spare... Spare, uh, luxuries. In part because there's no city-states around to give them extra luxuries of things. And so, that's slowing down the AI a bit, too. Which, you know, is nice that we're all slow together. <laughs> we're all just a little bit special. I don't have the most gold in reserve, but I do have enough gold to get an education, a uh, research agreement, rather, if for the love of God, Catherine would make some money. Or someone with money signed an agreement for me. That'd be pretty cool. I tell you what, I am going to get a temple here. I also tell you what, I need so many things. I need so many things. Um, why don't we cut that? And we'll get that here. That allows me the opportunity to build some stuff here in my capital. Also, I need to put you back on. Why the hell would I even want you on growth focus anyway? That's stupid. I shouldn't have you in growth focus. Just keep building stuff. Because, uh, like hell if I can grow you. We can use Coliseums. I do not have that technology yet, though. Kind of tried to go after education as fast as I could. Uh, university... Really? You fucked that word up? Universities would be pretty useful for my science output. Yeah, let's go ahead and get this city here. It puts it a bit closer to York. I like that. And I don't really care enough to like try to put this city here. I mean, that's not the worst city ever. You know, I could build something, like, even on the bananas. Just so I could get those second spices. And those would be spare luxuries for me to sell. Uh, this will be a spare luxury for me to sell. And I definitely want the city here. Yes. Okay. You can lurk around here. Because I'll be damned if I want anything pillaged. I'll be damned if I want a barbarian camp spawning around here. That would be bad news bears. But I'm going to get a harbor in this city. I just don't want to build a road that far to hook them those two up. I probably won't build a harbor here, though. It's not too terribly far from York. Could also just get flat caravans, since China did build a city here. Okay, let's get my fourth city. Not the greatest city. Not the worst city, either. We want these things. If you could get me those things, that would be great. Of course, I am at negative four happiness, which is absolutely horrendous. Slows down practically everything. You just might not, might as well not even bother. Well, no, you might as well do bother. I mean, one food, two hammers is better than, uh, just two hammers. Can't argue with that. Let's go ahead and mine. We are so happy deprived right now, it's terrible. I could really use Colosseums. 
I, uh, wouldn't mind buying a luxury from someone, but they just don't have any to spare. Just that type of game. Just that type of game. Well, just gonna have to get better. Been helpful if I found more natural wonders. I did find a few. It'd also be helpful if I bought a pagoda. So many things would be helpful. And I don't have things right now. It's pretty terrible. Uh, we're gonna get metal casting, though. That'll be nice. Establish trade route. That's the best we got, huh? Hmm. That's a thing. It should be a fairly well-protected trade route. Uh, this little bit over here kind of concerns me, but I think we'll probably be fine. Uh, hmm. Just hang around here, I guess. I don't have construction yet. I do have guilds, so I can start trading posting the, uh, the jungle tiles. I guess I could start moving towards there to do that. Oh, Research agreement. Thank you so much for popping that up. I so need that. No. No, you don't. Just continuing to be like religious warfare and slaughter all around here. Chinese missionaries, you know, uh, Mayan pers uh, missionaries, Celtic missionaries. Scoreboard is uh, interesting in that Kathy is the one who's in last place. You know, I never really explored around here. So it does give me a little bit of an opportunity to do so. Interesting to have seen that barbarian unit there with a settler. It's nice, though, that the AI would be slowed down a bit by that. You better believe it would have been. That is my only source, so I can't advocate that. Boudicca is plotting against me. Thank you, I am not terribly surprised. I do want that extra source. As a matter of fact, I probably should have just transitioned to... Like, we'll go ahead and chop that down. That turns that into a two food, one hammer tile. Which you're not too terribly interested in working. If I gave it to you, then yeah, it's a superior tile. Let's go ahead and buy this. Uh, we need to get the start. As a matter of fact, uh, you come down here. You head to this island so that barbarian units don't spawn on it. There's uh, an encampment with a hand axe. Now the spy is coming along two turns and ten turns. Neat. Alright. Not not terrible. Not terrible. Not terrible. Need to get this done though. I would have liked I would like to get another another worker. That is a thought. Let's get another another worker. Don't need that granary. I am at zero happiness. I'm about to be a negative one because York's about to grow. Oh well. Good job, York. You grew. Maybe I can find a convenient natural wonder around here. It doesn't look like it, though. Oh well. If I improve that spices, then I can sell it. Uh, trade it away for luxury without losing the happiness. Sometimes it'd be nice to be the Netherlands. The call completed Alhambra. Korea has discovered every civilization in the world. Uh, more fittingly, though, they uh, were the first to research printing press. So they're the ones who uh, founded the World Congress. I get to make a proposal. Uh, we get to do those things. World's Fair would be very useful for me. It will probably succeed. It depends on what's uh, suggested in exchange. Pakal is plotting against me. That's not a surprise either. I am incredibly weak military-wise. And I could use a few composite low... Uh, a few composite bowmen to uh, make myself seem less weak, although at this point I might as well just like build a few crossbowmen. At any rate, uh, banking, because that is certainly worth the most science. 1,444 science, and I only get 64 per turn. That saves me so much. 35 turns, huh? We'll have to uh, see what Pakal says. Very useful. Very useful tech. Slingshotted me to Renaissance era. He did not discover it either. He uh, does not know it was me. Yes. Primary reason for suggesting World's Fair. 
uh, is to uh, get the free social policy from the civil reward, but it's also to get a slight uh, diplomacy boost with uh, AIs. My declaration of friendship expired. You yes. want to renew that, don't you? Fantastic. I do need one friend. We have two spices? How? Sometimes the interface glitches. I'm also going to blame my eyes. Maybe they just like, for momentarily like, blurred there. <laughs> Who can say? Who can say? Let's go ahead and fortify you there. Alright. I would like to get Declaration of Friendship with more AIs. One is simply insufficient. Coliseum should definitely be a focus of mine. Although I would like to maybe get that second cargo ship. Uh, Lighthouse, Coliseum, uh, Worker, Coliseum. Since we very much uh, need some extra happiness. Eh, we are certainly lacking on that front. That's the first Council of Seoul. Good, maybe Korea will want to be friendly with me. That'd be pretty nice. I would uh, very much appreciate that. Barbarians are quite a problem. We are slowly continuing to accumulate faith. Of course, I didn't start on that early. I just uh, threw faith away. Yes! Maybe you won't kill me, and you have so much gold. You are swimming in money. Yes! Thank you. I have friends now. I don't know whether I want to sign research agreements to those friends, because they are doing a great job of teching, but, uh... Yeah. Also, I don't have to actually invest any policies, uh... Other than tradition and just hop straight into rationalism. My uh, slow culture generation is probably due to the lack of steady states and the fact that I didn't get any ruins which increased my culture output. I usually, you know, end up putting like a policy if not two or even three in something. But most likely like one to two uh, before rationalism unlocks. In this situation though, just due to low culture output, I haven't had to worry about that. Um... The Pantheon that produces one culture from jungle tiles would have been fairly useful here. Uh, thinking back on it, I just figured, since the Celts were so close to me, uh, that I might as well just forgo it. And especially with China and Pakal right there, too, like, it's been a complete religious bloodbath. Like, any hopes of me holding onto that Pantheon would just be gone. I just have so many other things to do than focus on religion, like how in Civilization IV, you know? The AIs can focus on religion. You need to do other things on higher difficulties, unless you're specifically going for a religion-style, like, run of the game. For a very specific strategy. The call is allowed in my territory just fine, because I did give him open borders as part of the deal to uh, attack China. You made it to that tile? That's swell. Fifteen turns until border growth, huh? That's not swell. 105 gold. I do not get a whole lot of gold per turn. Uh, when is... When are my gold... 31 turns, huh? Well, I doubt I can make that much better. When's my deal with... My deal that gives away the gold per turn. 227. That's gonna be a long while. I'll get some gold back. Uh, basically, next turn. Also get pearls back as well. So that's not so bad. I might as well just go ahead and mine up though. I'm not gonna have the gold to get that for a bit. Unless I start trading away more luxuries, which I shouldn't. Uh, I can finally get uh, lumber mills now. That wouldn't be too terrible. Wouldn't be the worst thing in the world to do. Um, with that in mind, I'm uh, go ahead and... Let's see. I moved you there. Go ahead and get a mine there, I guess. Alright. Hey, yeah. 
I'm starting to build a network of friendships now. But there's uh, enough angry AIs on the board that they are managing to do some fighting amongst themselves, which is pretty nice. Oops, pressed the wrong button there. Also, it is turn 200. So I suppose I should bring an end to yonder video. So go ahead and do that. Not that long of a video, but we are plowing through these turns rather quick. See you later.